trying. I'm 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 trying. I
Ando. Because sa take others, I feel others. Kasi this is where my life change. Yung pagkakilala ko kay Lord, mas lumalim. Because my life before, going here sa Hong Kong is different. I believe, the things what I do, I don't have really a relationship to God. So, sa bawat topics and praise, uh, verses na memorize ko at na pag-aralan, ang dami kong na-realize. Little did I know God slowly convicting my heart. Yung mga salita niya, every verses hit my heart sa lahat ng aspect ng buhay ko. So, while attending Sunday service and continue seeking the Lord is the most fulfilling experience that I have experienced. Because every Sunday going here to church and hearing the word of God is like my soul is rested. Because physically, I'm not okay. Emotionally, mentally, I'm not good. That is a fears. Sorry, but the Lord. Ah, uh, yeah, that time is a fears because of the Lord. As so I was uh, upright and here in Hong Kong. And thanks God that God's bring, like my employer said, thanks be to God that you're here. That's, that's why I'm super blessed. So, so yung mga salita ni Lord yung kinapitan ko, dahil ngayon sa sakit ko, you don't know when you have, uh, may bukol ka sa ano, you don't know yung we, we know if it's benign or whatever, you know, but God is so good na benign siya. So, yung mga salta ni Lord yung kinapitan ko, and I slowly surrendering my life to God. And everything na kinakatakutan ko, I remember, isa sa mga good friend ko dito, is mga kabatch ko din. So, di, sinabi, inas niya ako, sabi niya, bakit daw parang di daw ako natatakot? Sabi ko, I am. I surrender everything to God. I cry out to God everything. So, God, give me peace. Siya talaga yung nagpapakalma sa akin kahit nakakatako. And you know what I discover? I am praising God. Super thankful ako kahit mahirap, nakakatakot, but I give my trust to God. Nagpapasalamat ako sa Diyos sa deliverance, salvation, peace, and joy na naranasan ko sa piling niya. And especially, the reconciliation namin ni Lord. Dahil before, wala akong relasyon sa Kanya. I know Him, but I don't have a relationship to Him. Dahil I was once lost. Para ako yung nawawalang tupa sa the parable of the lost sheep. You can check that. It's a very good parable. Look at it, verse 1 to 7. Hinanap niya ako. Kahit makasalanan ako, dinala niya ako dito sa Hong Kong para muli magkaroon kami ng totoong relasyon. And now, I thank God and praise God that He guided me sa Galilee Agency, to my employer's family, and to meet all of you, my brothers and sisters. And also to my still family, I praise God and thank God that He gave me a chance, a second chance, to serve Him as a part of volunteers here in Spill. I was baptized with the Holy Spirit and decided to follow Jesus. And this is one of the verses I learned sa GIC. By Philippians 4.13, everyone agency, I can do all things through Christ who in me. Philippians 4.13, everyone agency, I can do all things through Christ who in me. So I just want to share another verse also. Kasi I just feel blessed. I just feel my sister actually shared this and I thank God. I praise God actually because in my family, we never talk about Word of God. We never. We know God. We go to church every day. We complete the Sundays to, you know, we think we're going to bless our family. But I praise God and thank God that my little sister is convicting her heart. You know, she's going to church also. Of course, it's she's my prayer warrior. Together, we pray for our family. So, ito yung, I just feel blessed 
I just want to share this verse to you. Kasi she named, this is the verse, the first verse that she shared to me. I never shared actually a verse to her. I just always, always encouraging her to go to church and hear the word of God. So she tells me, um, Psalm 04, 104, verse 33. I will sing to the Lord all my life. I will sing praise to my God as long as I live. And praise to God. Salamat to God. To God be all the glory. Amen.